Hey, what's up, you sons of legends? How's it going? Kiwi and Bacon here. Today, I decided to try a sweet tempo mage deck that was made by Last Desire. It's called the Last Desire Tempo Aggro Mage. Um, it looks pretty sick. Um, I have been destroyed by this deck today, unfortunately. I was playing, um, was playing a discard warlock deck um, and I ran into this specific deck a couple times I was not prepared for the flame strike I was definitely not prepared for the water elemental and the shenanigans with the uh, the arcane explosion you know like cold sorcerer blood mage arcane explosion and then your entire board just disappears uh, that's not too cool actually I was not prepared for that either um, other than that, the, the deck looks pretty sick, um, I have to say. I'm going to give it a shot. Hopefully you guys enjoy it. And hopefully you guys don't mind the background and the audio and everything that's different than usual because my computer is dead. I'm getting it fixed right now. I'm getting uh, the parts shipped in uh, so I can fix it. Um, and hopefully we should be good to go uh, at the beginning of next week. But uh, in the meantime, I'm using a computer I rented from the library at the university. Um, so, let's give this a shot, and now at the end of the video, um, we are going to have the weekly giveaway, because it is Thursday, which is one of the reasons I got this crappy laptop, um, and it's actually running OBS and the game decently well, so I'm not too scared about that, and I'm hoping we don't get into, like, well, yeah, shamans, shamans is another thing, it, it, but you know, shamans is shamans. They won't be they won't be as good next expansion, so they can play shaman all they want right now. They're gonna get crushed, I'm assuming. Later on. Alright, so well, that's a pretty decent starting hand. Babbling book. Well, uh, I won't say no to an extra flame strike actually. It's pretty decent spell, especially against Shaman, so go ahead, dude. Go ahead. Gonna play Sorcerer's Apprentice. Um, he's probably gonna manage to kill it. If he does, too bad. If he doesn't, I've got the Arcane Intellect. Uh, Frostbolt, Arcane Blast, and everything good. That comes from the arcane intellect. So that's pretty good. He is going to kill it though, so that's a bit unfortunate. You know what? I'm just gonna torture it. The benefit from arcane blast is that it works well with the uh, flame waker, it also works well with spell power. As I was saying, decent. I was hoping it would actually hit the trog, because if it didn't, um, he could have played a spell or something, pump up his, uh, his trog and hurt me. Ow. How dare you? Mm. I think we're just gonna arcane intellect and ping his uh his totem. That is definitely what it looks like. That flame strike is gonna be pretty damn helpful actually. Bring it on, dude. Do your worst. Mm, I can actually kill it, which that's that's pretty good. I mean, I kill it.
I was like, oh, damn, it's not turn 7 yet. I can't Firelands Portal. But that was an actual decent draw. I'm not too scared. All right. I think it's going to be the portal here. Yep. A portal it is. Let's do this. Ah, that's not so good. Now, if it was if it was the actual Druid of the Claw, uh, either or, you know, one of the one of the two, um, it would have been decent. Okay. Sure, you can definitely hex that. I don't mind. Um, I'm gonna draw a card. Do I just? I think. I, yeah. I mean, that's pretty good, All right? Okay, it's not as good because it did kill. Okay, yeah. Well, not as cool as I thought it was gonna be. But I tried. <laughs> I thought it was at least gonna kill one of the other ones. Um... There is a lot at stake. Ow. Alright. Yeah, um, I'm going to have to ask you to die, please. Let's make magic. Thank you. Please play many cards again, so that way I can flame strike and ruin your dreams. That would be fantastic. He did play a lightning bolt, he played in the hex. Ah, there's the second hex. Sadness. I think it's going to be flame strike here. Goodbye. I mean, I could use the spell power for the far extra damage for face. Do I really want to do that? Not really. Now I kind of want to, though. There's a target on the board. So I can just ping it. So I'm not too scared. Plus, Water Elemental is pretty good, and he doesn't have any more cards. If you play something big, you have Fireball. There we go. Alright. Fair's victory. Now, if, you get, if you guys are skeptical, um, don't be. Uh, this deck is actually pretty good. It's very, very good against Warlocks and Hunters. I don't know what... Well, yeah, I do know why. I mean, it's because they play a lot of aggressive stuff and you just tend to kill that pretty easily. Um, but yeah, I mean, if I do get to, to play against a Zoo Lock or something, I'll be able to show you guys. Um, and I don't know if I mentioned that earlier, but... Uh, we're having the giveaway at the end of the video, so thank you for participating this week. Um, if you did, of course, leave that retweet on the giveaway tweet. Uh, yeah, sure, why not? Uh, yeah, sure, why not? Uh, uh, the worm would be pretty good here. Can I have a worm? No? Oh, 
well, that Arcane Blast is pretty good. Um, why don't I coin out... Why don't I coin out the Cold Sorcerers? Because I can Sorcerer's Apprentice... I'm gonna play Sorcerer's Apprentice. Um, might be a bad deal. However, if he plays his three four, it dies, which is a good deal for me. Question though, does he have explosive trap? That is explosive trap. All right. Sadness. So I did play that because that was free and all. have traded one and pinged and kept it and I didn't think that was good enough okay well that's pretty good uh, the hits at three uh, three six so it's still alive he'll have to spend another resource to kill it come on dude we just have hero power and that's it because if you do, you're going to be in trouble. Oof, well that's good. Alright, Azure Drake it is. Um, you can't play Eagle Horn Bow anymore. At least not this turn. What does he have that's big and scary? A high main. Sure, that can be big and scary, I guess. Uh, I'm gonna play Mana Worm. I'm going to play a Frostbolt here. Just so he can't attack with it. Then I'm just gonna torch his face for four. He's frozen, he can't do much. And he's not playing Mage, so he doesn't have Flame Strike. I'm not too scared about that. All right, Houndmaster is Houndmaster is a thing. Attack here. Gonna play. Gonna actually play Azure Drake. Apprentice. Missiles. And at least killed one. I'm gonna trade. The reason I'm trading is because um, I'm trying to outvalue him. Okay, I'm gonna play my Ragnaros. Wherever it hits, almost guaranteed. Because I, I can just win right now. It's either win or kill his Ragnaros, and he's probably screwed. There you go. Right? Sniper Rag. It's pretty, it's pretty simple to, uh, to play against Hunters, like I mentioned earlier. Um, that, that and Zulox, of course. All right, I did, yeah, I didn't get the the right uh, start, you know, the start I wanted um, because of that explosive trap. 
there was no real way for me to play around it. I could have waited a turn and ping this face and do nothing. I could have. Was that the right play to do? I don't. I don't really think so. Okay, well, babbling book is good. I'm gonna drop those. I don't need that right now. Spell power is better later in the game. All right. Oof. Two sorcerer's apprentice can be really fun if you can manage to make them live on the board. Nice barriers, not too good though. Offensive, offensive cards are way better. All right. Um. I guess I'm just going to play one Sorcerer's Apprentice. An attack. So far this looks pretty decent. Um, is he going to Hero Power? What is he going to do? Because he technically could use his Hero Power to attack into my 3-2. I could just rat for one, draw a card. And that works as well. I'm just gonna ice barrier. Now, it's mind games. Yeah, they might think, oh, it might be our. It might be a mirror, it might be counter spell. might be a few things it is not gonna play mana worm gonna play cult sorcerer and arcane blast his little three three how he knows it's not counter spell which is pretty good for him Ah. Ah. I don't like that. He knows it's not effigy either. So I have to kill Fendral. We're gonna have to ping. And the problem is I'm already I didn't do damage yet and I'm already out of cards. So that's that's pretty annoying actually. I'm probably gonna lose this game. Um, Druid is very efficient against this deck, unfortunately. I don't have any cards. And I only have a secret that is technically useless on the board. So unless I get some card draw or... You know, Arcane Missile is useless. Well then. Okay. I can't really deal with that right now. Mm, I guess I can play a water elemental and ping Arison. Yeah, 5, 4, and 3, 6 actually do trade evenly in ping classes. Ouch. That nourish though. That's not cool. Ah, uh, that's not cool. <laughs> well. All right. Aha. Uh -huh. 
uh, arcane intellect. Please, something good. Well, looks like blood mage into frostbolt. It's not so great, but it'll do for now. Uh, when blood mage dies, I get a card draw. The only the only thing that could save me right now would probably be Ragnaros. Like if I draw my rag right now and I kill his rag, we might have a chance. We'll see. Now is that a spell or a minion? Alright, well, Firelands Portal is pretty good. It's Leroy. I'm gonna... do this thing. Trade. Draw an extra card. Time's up. Let's do this. Well, Leroy, it's effectively 11 damage for 7. Yeah, it's pretty good. Now he's going to kill it, though. Or is he? Yeah, he's probably going to. He's probably going to. There, There is no way he doesn't kill it. He gets, like, Living Root or... Swipe... Moonfire, ping, whatever. It doesn't matter, he's gonna kill it. He's really looking for something to kill it with. <laughs> Interesting. Claw, yeah, I forgot the claw. Sure. Well, you do take three, uh, four damage. Four damage. Well. Uh, that's not cool. Uh, we might be able to clear the board somehow. Arcane missiles. Alright. Ah, uh, it comes down to this arcane missiles. Right? Nice. Okay. So we killed this giant. What sh could we get that would potentially help us here? Ragnaros. That's pretty much it. Or Arcane Intellect into a bunch of spells. Yeah, like this. If we actually do get another... You know, like another Fireball. We'll see. Yeah, I'm just gonna start taking a beating. Ooh, Ragnaros. Okay, I like this. Ragnaros face, please. Please face. Please go face. Yes! Alright, so if he doesn't heal right now, and he doesn't finish me off, we might have a chance. Okay. Alright. Feral Rage. And he gets back his 8. Uh. Even if I get the other fireball, it's not enough. Crap. I'm gonna play other Azure, Azure Drake, Azure Drake. Mana Worm is not enough. Come on. So close. 
or maybe just not close at all. He's just he just keeps drawing and drawing. Maybe we have no chance whatsoever. Even with the face knife from Rag. He he actually just played that Feral Rage and it negated. It completely negated the effects of the Ragnaros. But I think that's lethal. I think that is lethal. Alright, come on, dragon. You got this. Alright, one fireball. Two fireballs. And that's the third win. There you go, guys. That was fun. That was really fun to play. It's been a while since I had such an easy time play as a as a mage, actually. <laughs> I'm not that good at mage. Even even actually, even when it was a mech mage meta, that was pretty terrible still. Um so yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed. I'm still gonna put the deck list in the description, of course. I did mention it was going to be the giveaway at the end of the video, so let's just do that right now. Um, mm -mm. All right, so prior to the video, of course, I did draw a name. So I just have the name written here. The winner of this week's giveaway is Stefano Rucci. So Stefano, I will uh, try reaching out to you to give you your two Hearthstone card packs. Thank you very much, everyone, for participating. And if you didn't win this time, um, there's always next week. And on uh, when they actually release the new expansion, I'm going to make a bigger, um, bigger, badder uh, giveaway. So that way, you know, more card packs. That's way there's more incentive for you guys to participate and everything. I think next week's giveaway is going to be on YouTube. Um, but yeah, Stefano, you won yourself two card packs. Congratulations. Uh, apart from that, I hope you guys leave a like, share, and subscribe. It means a lot to me, and it helps the channel grow. I am going to try to fix my computer for next time, and I'll see you guys in another video. Thanks a lot for watching. Bye-bye.